Hi, this is Nev Lapwood from Snowboard Addiction. We're up here at the Airhouse Airbag in Whistler. This is a quick tutorial about how to hit your first airbag. If you get the opportunity to hit something like this, take it. Don't be intimidated. It's super fun and it's a very safe environment to perhaps try something you've always wanted to try but never felt confident enough to actually do on a park jump. The first thing you want to do is take a look at the jump and see what that shape's like. A lot of airbag jumps are very poppy, which could be unrealistic. This one is not too poppy. It's kind of realistic to what a 30 to 40 foot park jump would look like. Have a look behind the airbag. How much is the gap that you need to clear to make it onto the airbag? It's easy to get excited and want to try something crazy. But your first jump, you should probably do a few straight airs just to get used to the feel of what that jump is like. Concentrate on getting a strong pop off that lip. Take all the speed you need for the jump and avoid doing a bunch of turns. If you turn too much, you're going to slow down and may not have enough speed to get off that lip properly. After a straight air, try some tricks that you're comfortable with. And remember to add good pop into them. Backflips are something that everybody wants to try on an airbag. It's very common to see people throw the backflip very hard off the lip. And I've even seen people smash their head against the lip of the jump. To avoid this, you want to make sure that you're getting strong pop off the lip as you're doing a backflip. With spins, you're going to be taking the same entry paths using your edges that you would be taking on the mountain to a regular park jump. So if you're spinning front side or back side off this lip, think about what entry line you're going to be taking so that as you fly off the lip, you're flying in a straight direction. If you get overconfident and try to spin something unusual that you're not used to, you may edge extra hard, which could throw you off the direction of the lip. You may hit the very side of the airbag or you could potentially even miss the airbag. Feel free to try some adventurous tricks for you, something you haven't tried before. Keep it safe, keep your helmet on, remember those entry pass, keep good speed. We're up here at the Airhouse Airbag in Whistler. I'm Nev Lapwood from Snowboard Addiction. Our goal is to improve your riding.